right, friends, welcome, welcome back to another super awesome wood log. Excited to have you all with me today. We got some cool work going on today. We're gonna be doing some drywall work. We're gonna do some lighting. Got some lights right here. So it's gonna be a great day. We're gonna do a bunch of other work as well. So anyways, let's get to it. Quite a while ago I replaced the exhaust vent fan. This is a new one. There was an old one that was right there and that's what we're patching right now. I installed these bigger exhaust vent fans in all the bathrooms. Uh, this was the one we had to move because there was actually a gas pipe running uh, right above it and this one was considerably taller than the old one so we couldn't put it in the exact same spot because there was a gas pipe running which runs down and runs to the stove which is right on the other side of this wall so we had to relocate it and do some drywall patch this is another exhaust vent fan that we replaced and we are going to replace that light fixture with a much bigger light fixture as you can see it doesn't really light up that room very much so we're going to get a new one on there Okay, here's our first light that we got replaced. And then here's our second light that we got replaced. Yeah, I wanted to quickly highlight another project that I did here. I installed these about two years ago or so. These are the metal fence posts that I installed and I got complete videos. You guys have probably seen me install those quite a, 
quite a few times, but we did uh, we did almost the whole fence here of galvanized metal fence posts. So they're all holding up pretty good. I think that was maybe a year and a half, two years ago or so. I didn't do any of these, but. See how our drywall's doing. It's getting dry. It's probably good for another coat. Do a quick sanding on it real quick. What I found with texture is uh, usually I do my first coat a really fine coat. So the first coat I do of texture is just fine, just leave it up there. And then the second coat I do a little bit, I do the heavy setting on the uh, the texture can and that usually sprays it pretty good. And sometimes you don't even need to knock it down. That's at least what I found. You obviously got to match what's on there. But uh, so we got the first coat on there. We're going to let that dry for a few minutes and we're going to put up our second coat. This is what we're looking like after our first coat of fine texture. Obviously we'll clean all this up. You. That's <laughs> crazy. <laughs> We also installed some art here. We installed that cross right there. All right, here's the end result of the drywall patch. All right, all right, that job's a wrap. Turned out pretty great. Uh, got some great stuff done. Uh, that drywall patch didn't quite turn out uh, super amazing, but the cool thing about it was uh, once I put up that exhaust fan uh, hood there, or not the hood, the uh, the vent cover, I guess is what you call it. 
uh, it really created a shadow over the patch so you can't really see it and any normal person that just walks in that bathroom is not going to be able to see it um, you know it's just if you're looking for it you might see it but uh, it turned out all right they had the they had the paint that matched so that was great got that in there the thing that I learned from this job is uh, when I was in st. Louis I was working with a great guy named Seth and he had this uh, he had this drywall ball that you would mix the drywall compound in and it had a little paddle that you hooked to your drill uh, and it just it mixed it perfectly man you didn't have any uh, you know any dry stuff in your compound at all it was just great ready to smooth out I'm gonna get one of those I got one for my employee but I haven't got one for myself yet I need to get one uh, they're not that expensive but uh, so be looking for that in the future vlog so anyways thank you all so much for tuning in like this video leave me a comment in the comment section below I'd love to chat with you and also subscribe to this channel you guys have a great day we'll talk to you later